So where am I going? Oh great, I'm starting to sound like them. Not like I haven't heard enough of that accent. So this is where Lopter is from. Was from. Let's not lose sight of the road, that could be... Unfortunate. And where am I going? Ah. I'm going to assume I'm going over there. Uh, alright, well. Ow. Thank you. For hitting my helmet. I did not really need that. But hey, at least I have my helmet on. Amber Creek. River Watch Hot Springs. Ooh. Doesn't that sound good? So this is Amber um, Creek. Where did Lofter say he was from? He mentioned many names from here. And I cannot remember any of them. I remember Pine something. Hello. Right. Citizen. Yeah. So I need to go speak with whoever runs this place, right? Suppose I, suppose I should probably take that off. Rangar! What? By the divines. Micaias, is that you? I was being I held in Brittle Run Cave, my loot. but the guard and someone else found me and got me out. Well, by all means, go inside. Have a drink and get some rest. He's the blacksmith. Actually, I think I'd like to stay out here and do some work with you. It'll be good for me. Of course. Grab a hammer. It's great to have you back. <laughs> I didn't know you were a blacksmith. Yes? Is there anything else you do around here that I should know about? I help Rangar around the forge. I'm his apprentice. He hasn't had any children to pass the knowledge on to. Uh. I feel honored that he's accepted me to learn everything he knows. I work hard every day to practice the craft. He really does know a lot. Well, that's good. Uh, is there anything you should tell me that you could tell me? Sorry, about Falskar. I knew someone from here once, but I'm not from here myself. I'm... Not even from Skyrim, originally. Falskar is a complex land. We've had a lot of war and death. Oh. Things have been pretty dark the last few years, but I think we'll pull through. After all, Olaf led our people through the treachery when we first arrived here. I'm sure Agnar will do the same for us now. Good thought. Well, you do good work. I'm going to go see if I can find the Jarl or... Whoever. See ya. See ya. You don't mind if I have a chat with your master, do you? I feel like it's a good thing to know the blacksmith. If you need anything, just let me or Rangar know. Will do. Hello? Mm -hmm. You're Rangar? Can I help you? Uh... What can you tell me about Amber Creek? I'm mostly looking for... where I can find the Arl. I'm a little new here. Amber Creek is named after the small stream it was built next to. And that one right there. The stream was, at the time, full of a rich mineral called Amber. However, over the years the Amber was all mined out. The creek slowly expanded, 
and eventually became a large river, like it is today. That amber fueled the growth of the town. Since then, we have adapted to make gold through other means. For some, trade. For others, farming. Then there are those who make gold through craft. Like me with my smithing. What have you got for sale? I'd love to see your wares. Blades, helmets, shields. Pretty much anything to suit your needs. Well, I'm not really much one for shields, but... Oh, indeed. Where did you get this? Oh, wow. You weren't kidding! You have some very good wares in here. And enchanted too, it looks like. Feels like. It's warm. Uh... I don't really... Could you melt this down or something? I don't really know what I would do with it. I'm going to keep those just in case. I mean... And this. I can't remember where I picked this up. Right. Uh... Well, thank you for what it's worth. Good luck on your journey. Thank you. I feel like I'm going to need it. Say, you wouldn't happen to have heard of anyone named... Can I help you with anything? You wouldn't have happened to know of a man named Lopter, would you? No? I'm going to guess not. Okay. Well, best place to ask about people would probably be at the inn. Right? Well, I suppose I should probably have a look around. One never knows. What's this? General goods store? Okay, good to know where that is. That's probably the longhouse. Their architecture is very similar to that of Skyrim. But their accents remind me more of my own land. It's a very pretty horse. Oh, I left my horse back in White Run, I think. I must have. I don't think it would have come with me. Anyway. When you are older, my son, for now just enjoy being young. That's the Jarl? If you say so. Do not dread, Wilhelm. You will grow up to be a great warrior. I am sure of it. He seems too young to be but a Jarl. if I keep practicing, I'll go do that right now. Of course, that's kind of what I thought about Balgriff, too. Oh, excuse me. Agnar says, if I'm going to make a good king, I'll need a strong lady by my side. I was thinking of Varna. <laughs> and right you are. Excuse me. How do you do? Well, I do very... Greetings. Interestingly. We found Micaius. I know you don't know me, but we did find Micaius, and he says the bandits are working for Ingvar. I don't know what this means, but you might. What? What led him to believe that? Such a statement cannot be taken lightly. Uh, he overheard them talking. They got orders from Ingvar to capture him, and I don't know what that means, but I'm hoping you can shed some light on the situation. This... this is bad news. It could very well mean the start of another war. Thank you for bringing me this information. Please, accept this token of my appreciation. I hate to ask more of you. You have already saved one of my people. But I don't have much choice. Long ago, when there was war between my family and the Yunvaldirs, there was a group of monks that served as our wise men and court wizards. They have since retired to a simpler life, but their roots are still there. 
They may know what Ingvar is up to. Please, go to Balin Priory, to the southwest, and talk to Brother Thorlo. See if he knows anything. Of course. Priory, huh? <coughs> you alright? I don't even know if that was him. Although I'm going to assume it was. A girl who wears armor. Have you spoken with Brother Thorlo yet? No, nope, but I'm going to. You're a smart man. And I'm going to check out the inn. Because... I mean, I'm not entirely sure... The hours around here, but... It strikes me that if it's getting dark, it's getting late, and that I should probably go to sleep. Like, I'll get much, but... Hmm. Well, this is a cozy little place. Hello? Whether you're looking for food and drink, or just a good time, you're in the right place. Well, I'm... Uh... Let me know if you'd like some mead. I'd like a room, actually. Of course. It's yours for a day. Thank you. Um... Do you know how to get to Skyrim from here? Wolf runs a ship out of the dock south of Borvald. At least, I think he still does. I haven't heard anything about him in a while. Oh, lovely. Uh... What have we got for drink and food? We have all sorts of food and drink for the weary adventurer. The weary? <laughs> well, that's certainly... Oh! You make your own mead here, local. Well, obviously you do. And it looks like you trade as well. I would love to try one. Thank you. <sighs> and some hork or stew, maybe. Thank you. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Excuse me. It's very good, sweetie. One day you'll be just like Clara. You really think so? Ugh. Thanks, Dad. Keep it up. You You'll be in here. Else. Let me know if you need anything else. Oh, I will. I tell you, I tell you, the dragonborn comes. Oh, my goodness. With a voice wielding power <laughs> of the ancient Lord Ars. Sorry, was he trained? Because he's one of the best bards I've ever heard. It's an end to the Hello. Of all Safe travels. Yeah. Beware, beware, the dragonborn comes. Wow. Okay, I'm going to be quiet now. For the darkness has passed and the legend yet grows. You'll know, you'll know, the dragonborns come. Amber Mead. I quite like it. Okay. I can't wait it, excuse to me. even more recipes. Hi, Everyone what can I do for you? What I made so far. Do you know a lot of songs? Because I have not heard very many very impressive bars, and you are one of them. I know plenty of songs. I wish I knew more, though. The bards kind of died off a while ago. I've been trying to recollect their work for years. 
However, some of the pieces are harder to get to than others. Right now, I believe there's one in the ruins of Holmer called the Wandering Bard. I'd love oh, to have I've it. Got to lay off the meat. If you have any spare time and could get it for me, I'll buy it off you. I'll pay Dang good it, too. Drinking all our meat. Of course. I'll see what I can do. I'm kind of running around everywhere, apparently. Fair travels. Y yeah, and fair singing. Ha ha ha. Right, I completely got distracted by which room was mine. Times are tough. I see. Right, let me... Good evening, miss. Can I play you a song? <laughs> miss! What is your flattering? Hard day's work Just in a the good mind. time? You're in the right place. Actually, I was... Need a drink? Amber mead is the best in all of Falscar, and it's our own special drink. Yeah, I can see that. I was actually wondering where I could buy a horse. I saw the stables out there, but, um... I seem to have left my horse on the mainland. I think the only spare horse we have in town is Gabriel's. He doesn't use it anymore, so he may sell it to you. Uh-huh. All right, I'll talk to him. Safe travels, friend. Indeed. A beautiful evening in Falskar. Yeah. Well, I don't know, it's kind of rainy. That doesn't really bode well for the rest of the weather. Huh. Uh... You, Gabriel? <coughs> no. Is he Gabriel? Hey. Excuse me. Greetings. Uh... Hello. Are you Gabriel? Is your horse for sale? I suppose so. I haven't had much use for him in a while. And he gets sad just sitting in his stall all day. I'll let him go for a thousand gold. <laughs> Do I even have that much? Uh, hold on. I'm going to count and figure it out in the morning. If you say so, I'm sure I'll find a use for him. Yeah, he's probably a good pack beast, no? Safe travels. Uh, well. Hello. I do. Hang on. Greetings. I think. I suppose so. I haven't had much use for him in a while, and he gets sad just sitting in I his stall all day. Tune my loot. I'll let him go for a thousand gold. Well, I actually do have a thousand gold, so I'll take you up on that offer. You won't regret it. He's a tad on the old side, but he's strong and brave. He's made it through a run-in or two with bandits over the years. He settled up in a stable on the east side of town. Solid brown with white hooves and a shining coat. Of course. I may not use him much anymore, but I still take good care of him. Hmm. Thank you. A bit old but tough is uh, just how I am too, so... Good to see you. Or see you around. Whatever. 